the end of the day. Now, questions have emerged especially online after a video surfaced showing a security officer at the ferry crossing seemingly receiving bribes to allow pedestrians using the ferry instead of using the Liwatoni floating bridge. This going against the law which stipulates the timelines when pedestrians can use the ferry crossing or the floating bridge. George Maringa reports. <laughs> It is this video filmed during the day that has raised eyebrows. A security officer is seen receiving what is seemingly a bribe at the barricade of the Likoni ferry channel. One by one, passengers hand in their share, then the guard grants them passage. The alleged bribes from pedestrians are to allow them access to the Likoni ferry channel, whereas they should use the Liwatoni floating bridge. <laughs> Kwa sababu makao yao anaoka ni mbali na kule bridge. Sasa anaona akifuka na bridge, akifuko pande wa pili na mlazima achukue tuktuk tuk ama pikipiki. Sasa ni gharama nyingine ambayo yeye hutoka ni tuda mpaka bridge, amechoka hasa fadhali aje na ferry alipe hiyo 20 ili avuke na kivuka kwake ni karibu yuengia kwake. Baba neno leo zungumzo hapa ni zahiri shairi ataki pofu anaona. Hapa si mtoto si mkubwa paka shilingi shirini. Zijana wengi wana rauko na kutazao kazini wajitafutia pesa zao kidogo wakifika hapa wazitoa. Shirini, 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 shirini. The floating bridge, which is also East Africa's first, was launched early last year. The 1.2 kilometer bridge stretches from Liwatoni in Mombasa Island to Rasbofu Peleleza in Likoni. <laughs> The Liwatoni pedestrian floating bridge is the first of its kind in the region and is designed to ease pressure on the Likoni ferry crossing by taking up most of the foot traffic, leaving the ferries to serve vehicular and cargo crossing between Mombasa Island and South Coast. <laughs> Kuna <laughs> From 6 a.m. to 8 a.m. and 4.30 p.m. to 7 p.m., pedestrians are not allowed to use the ferry route and have to use the floating bridge. The Kenya Ferry Services has not issued any formal statement and efforts to reach them for a comment were futile. George Maringa, KTN News. All right, so let's get back to politics. And just what is the President Uhuru Kenya?